Hello and welcome back for another episode of SPAC News. Today is Friday, April 22nd. I'm Tony and this is what I have for you today. I'll be taking a look at LMF acquisition opportunities. If you find any of the following information useful, hit that like button. If you would like to continue receiving daily SPAC news from this channel, make sure to subscribe. Give me your feedback on this video and the channel overall. I would love to hear from you. Just leave a comment below. Straight out of Tampa, Florida, LMF acquisition opportunities, trading under the ticker symbol LMAO, announced today that they have entered into a definitive agreement to combine with Denver, Colorado based C Star Medical. C Star Medical, as their name implies, is a medical technology company developing extracorporeal therapies to reduce the consequences of excess inflammation of vital organs. Extracorporeal meaning the device is external or outside of the body. LMAO IPO'd in January 8, 2021, and it took them nearly 15 months before finding a target company. This transaction is expected to provide C-Star Medical with access to capital markets and thereby positioning the company to accelerate the development and advancement of its lead programs for acute kidney injury in both pediatric and adult patients as well as advances to other C-Star Medical programs in acute and chronic indications. C-Star Medical's most recent breakthrough was getting a patent on its selective cytophoretic device or SCD technology. LMAO is led by Bruce Rogers and is both the Chief Executive Officer and Chairman of the Board. The combined company will be known as C-Star Medical Holding Corporation and will operate under the same management team as C-Star Medical which currently is led by Eric Skarloff, the transaction estimates a total value of approximately $85 million. Here's an interesting tidbit. The Dow Chemical Company Pension Plans is currently invested in Seastar, and with this as an existing investor of Seastar Medical will further participate in the transaction through a pipe investment. This business combination is expected to be completed in the third quarter of this year. LMAO previously closed at $10.14, was up one cent for the day for a gain of 0.1%. Not bad considering all three major indices were down. The S&P was down 122, the Dow was down 981, Nasdaq down 335, with a losing week due to rising interest rates and inflation worries. And that wraps it up. I hope you found this information useful. Please hit that like button. Subscribe to continue receiving daily SPAC news from this channel. Have a good weekend. Later.